Supreme Court has dismissed the appeal filed by the former governor of Adamawa State, Mr. Mosala Yako, seeking for his reinstatement as governor of the state. Mr. Yako had approached the Apex Court to order his reinstatement to office uh, after ruled in his favor that his impeachment by the State House of Assembly was illegal and ordered that his entitlements as a governor while his tenure lasted should be paid to him. Delivering his judgment, the lead justice, Justice Mohammed Musa, states that the request sought by the former governor at the Apex Court had already been withdrawn by his counsel in the lower court. According to him, having withdrawn the relief voluntarily at the Court of Appeal, the appellant has no basis for seeking the same relief again at the Supreme Court. He therefore dismissed the appeal in its entirety for lack of merit. It was an interesting judgment. It's actually what we expected because what they have uh, delivered this morning represents the true and correct position of the law. Without even going into the merits of the case, you heard the justices say that the particular relief which they are seeking in this court, they withdrew it in the court for appeal. First and foremost, there was no proper appeal before this court. Forget about all the noise that the appellant has been making about this case that is going to be reinstated. He knows that the aspect of the reinstatement, he withdrew it in the court of appeal. We were there in the court of appeal when that was withdrawn. So we found it very surprising that this, his same lawyers, the very same persons who withdrew that particular relief, also filed this appeal again to contend the same thing they had abandoned. It was a well-reasoned out decision. Comments have been made about withdrawal. But it's also necessary to point out why did counsel at the Court of Appeal withdraw that contentious six relief. He acknowledged at the Court of Appeal that his tenure has expired. And that was the basis of withdrawal of that relief at the Court of Appeal. So therefore, there was no grounds of appeal whatsoever before the Supreme Court. And uh, that has been decided.